Hey guys, let's talk about the three major movements that literally changed how fast I was able to get back to working out. Um, I suffered an annular tear uh, in, my, in my spine uh, about eight weeks ago uh, as of Monday. And um, mentally it was very tough because it took me completely out of my element, you know, you know being in the gym, taking care of myself and um, you know, being able to demonstrate all the movements and, and everything. <clears throat> but at the same time, like being able to demonstrate all of the movements um, does not make you a great coach. And so it was a good time for me to really focus on, um, you know, business um, and the people that we have. And um, it made me take a step back. It made me have a perspective, different perspective on how, I'm, how I was warming up. And uh, so this is the movement, movements, that changed everything for me. And if you're not doing this, and if you have low back pain, these are the three movements that you should do every single day. First movement, it's called the curl up. Super simple movement, but you have to be very specific here. So, <clears throat> one leg is going to lay out, okay? The other leg is gonna stay up. Laying flat, keeping your arms kinda crossing your body. I wanna take my shoulders and curl up. Keep the head neutral, don't think chin down, just keep the head neutral. You have muscles, big muscles, sternocleidomastoid right there that is going to get engaged here. So you're holding for 10 seconds, back down, come up, 10 seconds there again, back down, and you're doing that five times, five times on each side. So five times on this side, five times on this side, but holding each position for 10 seconds. The next movement is going to be your side plank. Side plank here, start on the knees. Arm can be up, arm can be on the side, however it works best for you, but keeping oblique pulled in. Five times on this side, five times on the other side, 10 second holds at each position. If you wanna make it more difficult, raise the opposite leg or shoot the legs both straight out. But five times on that side, five times on the other, three times on each side, one time on each side. Same thing for the curl up. So it's what we call five, three, one scheme. The last movement <clears throat> is a bird dog. So I don't want this motion, don't want this motion. I want it right in the middle. Maintaining my midline, shooting my heel. My heel should be pointed. Arm should be up like I'm doing a thumbs up. Maintaining my belly in that neutral position as much as I possibly can. You're trying to stabilize. So again, five times like this, five times like that. It's 10 second holds on each side. Um, for each each hold three on each side and one on each side I promise you guys if you do this and if you incorporate this into your routine on a daily It will change the foundation of how your spine is able to stabilize you in any movement in any position. I hope this helps you guys Stay healthy